I get it that you want to have a relationship with Dante. I see how much you love your kids and that you've done your best to be a good father to them. I see how you love Michael and Morgan and- Listen, okay, hold on. Help me. Go to Dante and tell him to give me a chance. That is not up to me. Y yes, it is Dante's up to call. you. It's because of you that my son looks at me like I'm a, like I'm a stranger. You owe me that. I owe you nothing. This must be, uh, if you knew what was good for you, you'd clear out of here now. Hey, I'm just here to meet Carlos and buy some of his fine Havana Royals. Yeah? There's no one out here but me and Milo. And the poor bloke you're using for target practice. <laughs> He's gone. I can see his face. Well, it's not really my business. I just know I'm supposed to meet Carlos here, and returning to the Haunted Star empty-handed is not an option. Get him out of here. Hey, it's a big pier. I think there's room for all of us. Yeah, because I was just thinking it's getting kind of crowded. Yeah, yeah, now, now that you mention it, um, <laughs> I'll leave you two to play your little game of cops and robbers. Or is it robbers and more robbers? Out. Come on. and you lied made up stories about who the father is could be this guy could be that guy I, I I thought that you were scared and confused you didn't know what you were doing I knew what I was doing I was protecting my child well I would have protected my child too yeah Sonny gangsters have a really great track record of keeping the people they love safe I would have taken responsibility and I sure as hell would have raised my son and you know had that. that chance with Michael and with Morgan and I give thanks every day of my life for them. But Dante is my firstborn. I can see that we're a lot alike. See, I just want to get is, to know him. This is him. so is typical of you. What? You see whatever you want to see, Sonny. Dante I was is cheated! My, my son never got to know me as his father. The damage is on you. Oh, you want to talk about damage? You want to talk about damage? How about the damage you did when you put a bullet in his chest? That wouldn't have happened if I had known he was my son. I am sorry that I let that investigation go on for as long as it did, but I will never, never apologize for keeping my kid out of your world of crime and corruption. You want to know the proof that I did right? The proof is the fine man that I raised. He has values. He knows right from wrong. He's a fine man upstanding man now can you look me in the eye and tell me that that's the man he would have turned into if he would have grown up in your world i didn't think so you're alive i'm up for a game of blackjack ethan's dealing Stamping in the back. Is that flamenco? I don't know. Okay, well, about two hours then. Perfect. Thank you. Ah, at last. Yeah, very soon now, I will be lighting up one of Cuba's most famous exports. He agreed to another meeting. Why wouldn't he? You're one of his best customers. I really appreciate your unerring understanding. Could we just talk about your daughter, please? What's to talk about? I'm not crazy about the idea of her getting mixed up with a cop, but it's her life, not mine. A cop who happens to be Sonny's son, which means she's in danger, Luke. Sonny didn't raise Dante. <laughs> you didn't raise Ethan, but the apple doesn't fall very far from the tree, does it? House wins again. No, you, you won that. What is this? Thanks for your help earlier. What help? Max and Milo had me cornered on that pier. If you hadn't created a diversion, I would have been nailed. Well, okay, blind luck and maybe a little boredom. I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I was just there for my cigars. I don't stick my neck out for anyone. Okay, well, a lot worse would have happened to my neck had you not done what you did, had Sonny known that I was poaching on his territory, so... Oh, God. Thank you.
you. Olivia, open up. Oh, honey, where's the fire? Okay. Whoa, 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 honey, is there something I should know about here? No, I just had a little reminder that life can change on a dime, so why don't we grab it while we can, huh? No more looking back on regretting things we didn't do. Okay, 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 honey, honey, I know, I know about life changing on a dime better than anybody, all right? But things are still a little bit scratchy between us. Okay, look, you are the only person left in this world that I give a damn about. I am here, and I love you, okay? <sighs> I'm not lying to you about anything anymore. So if you're sitting on any more lies, now is the time to tell me. I got nothing to hide. Any wine. 